guys is going on my name is Louis and God bless every single one of you today is April 5th 2024 and welcome to the Grand Supreme News channel all right guys so we have some urgent information coming out if you can please share this video and just looking at this title it's not good you have experts are saying that there's a possibility there's gonna be some more shaking in the rotten apple so we have all the updates here guys very important information if you can please share this video and it says here you have new jersey gov said the state has activated state emergency operations center so they're preparing for the aftershock here guys very important you share this video we have more breaking news updates here we go the holland tunnel to New Jersey will be temporarily held for inspection. Expect delays. So the reason why all this is happening, I do believe because they know that uh, aftershock is gonna come. Many residents are not pleased. You have some residents saying, hey, you send us the alert 25 minutes after? Yep. And remember, guys, I posted a video yesterday about the Midwest. Here we go. I want to show you this really quick. It's going to be really quick. All right. So I did talk about this uh, yesterday. Midwest, you need to hear this before April the 8th. This is the one right here, right? Um, all right. So the Midwest, that's basically the warning system not activated. All right, so I warned that there's a possibility some of these uh, text alert and warning system is not going to function. It happened today. It happened today. You can ask those that live in Jersey, the Rotten Apple, those regions. They received the text, uh, the text alert, but uh, it was already 25 minutes, 30 minutes, 40 minutes later. So again, uh, Midwest, you need to watch this before April 8th, solar eclipse. Guys, this video, I did talk about the earthquake of the rotten apple. You may want to check this out. I do believe that the reason why this is happening is because April the 4th, yesterday, planets alignment. All right, so I do believe that's what happened. And uh, we are getting closer and closer to uh, the solar eclipse on Monday. It's very important you guys check out these videos. It seems like solar eclipse video, nobody want to watch them. But this is very important because I'm giving very uh, some good information about upcoming events. And I did warn about the warning system and the text alert. So it's very important to check out these videos because, uh, again, it gives you an update and awareness of things to come. All right, so we're going to see what's going on here. Uh, we're going to start with, uh, oh, by the way, they're telling people stop calling 911. You know what? Here we go. Don't call 9 -1, you know what? To report earthquakes. After one town gets 100 calls in minutes. <laughs> man. I know people out there in California, it's like, man, they're really pa uh, paranoid. Uh, we get like uh, six point plus. But here's the thing. Nobody want to be in that situation feeling the ground shake. All right, let's go with this one first. Once again, guys, uh, I know many of you don't like the solar eclipse video. That's like the lowest views out of all the videos I upload. But these are very, very important stuff that I'm putting out. And for many that is going, that's heading towards Texas and those Midwest uh, states, you may want to check out my videos because I'm putting a lot of information, good stuff that uh, gives you some kind of uh, preparedness and just in case now I do believe the warning system is not going to be 100% accurate if something happens let's say during the solar and again I do believe that uh, text and all that mm -mm, it ain't gonna function emergency responders throughout North Jersey are urging many to refrain from unnecessary 9-1 you know what calls in the wake of Friday mornings reported Craig now, guys, I did make a video 11 o'clock in the morning. The problem with this platform is that they gave me certain times, so they sent out notifications. 
I don't know why they do that. They say, hey, you can send out, not um, you know, you can upload a video at 3 o'clock. We send out notifications. Again, that's, that's the platform. So my video was already done around 11 o'clock in the morning. I had to wait three hours, though. All right, so it says here, various uh, blue departments, fire departments, and emergency management offices have posted the request on their platform, again, Facebook pages, noting that uh, residents reserve calls for specific emergency only. So I did watch the video, and guys, I post a lot of videos on my Twitter page. If you guys want to check it out, follow me on Twitter. The link will be in the comments box. I don't know, guys. I, again, I just feel like it was. It had to be stronger than a point four. I mean, a four point seven. That thing was really powerful. Really powerful. It had to be. Again, at first it was a five point five, and then it was downgraded to a four point seven. I believe it was a five point five, close to a six point oh, and that thing was very powerful. Everybody's sharing the video on Twitter. The Sleeping Giant, once again, USGS, is reporting a 4.8, 5 kilometers northeast of Lebanon, New Jersey, at 10.23 a.m. I got a video coming up about Lebanon. So, again, they are putting out the warnings, telling the Sleeping Giant, don't get involved, we are going to strike. So, we're going to get to that one, too. That's going to be my next video. The Epic Center was near Reddington in Huntingdown. County, according to a post on X from the governor of New Jersey. All right. So once again, guys, make sure you check out my videos. I posted videos today, some very good ones. We have activated our state emergency operations center, says the post. Please do not call 9-1, you know what, unless you have an actual emergency. Instead of calling emergency services, first responders recommended concerned citizen check on family members and neighbors, especially elderly residents who may need assistance. Guys, I'm telling you, uh, I do believe there's going to be more. I do believe there's going to be more shake. All right, so please be prepared spiritually, physically, and mentally. All these planet alignments, and I post a video, I do believe that it has something to do with uh, this great shake. And this, uh, this is rare. This is extremely rare uh, quake that's happening in that region. The County College of Morris closed Friday as a result of the quake, with all buildings uh, evacuated to keep the facility community safe. Morris County Gov offices were also closed due to a gas leak. Wow. So, again, guys, there's multiple facility that's closing. All right. So, that's one of the articles they are urging residents out there. Don't call 911. You know what? The reason why they do that is because, again, um, the phone line is extremely busy. And, you know, it's... It's very important if you look if you're doing okay if there's nothing wrong with you again don't call 911 you know what because there's other people that might need it that's much more important situation all right so we're gonna go with this one here now all right so we're gonna see what's going on with this one once again experts are saying that there's a possibility aftershock all right so once again guys I do believe that there's gonna be some shake to come and I did talk about the Midwest. I talked about that earthquake in Missouri. And that was uh, four days ago, that video. Give me a second here, guys. Let me just fix this really quick. There we go. It says here a rare, there you go, shake the NY area Friday morning, rattling parts of the Rotten Apple, Connecticut, and New Jersey. You guys seen the video I posted yesterday? The Statue of Liberty? Lightning? And I warned that the Rotten Apple 
keep celebrating the abomination. You want to light up the, the buildings with all that type of colors? Mm-hmm. And this, again, a sleeping giant leader declaring the abomination. Now, all of a sudden, the rotten apple is getting some, again, they are seeing some stuff here. And I do believe it is a sign. Give me a second here, guys. I'm going to have to pause some of this stuff here. Now, the preliminary 4.8 uh, shake struck near Lebanon, New Jersey. All right. So we're going to skip some of this stuff here. I want to see about the after shock. The site later reported that a 2.0 aftershock was felt in Bemister, New Jersey around 1 p.m. Two other aftershock, another 2.0 and 1.8 happened in the afternoon, but are normal and are not expected to cause further, you know what? This is coming out from the Rotten Apple Gov. All right, so this is what she posted. So at 2.56 p.m., 2.56 p.m. 30 minutes ago. Right now, it's 2.37. All right, so you're not going to see this video until maybe 5 o'clock or 6 o'clock. Like I say, guys, notification. They don't give me notifications like that, so I have to wait every three hours. Uh, big shout out to the platform. Thank you for that. Following this morning, 4.8 magnitude Craig, three much smaller aftershock hit our region 1.8 magnitude at 12.31 p.m. 2.0 magnitude at 1.14 p.m. and 2.0 magnitude a few minutes ago. Aftershock of these size are normal and are not expected to cause any events. Here's the thing, guys. Um, you need a an expert when it comes to these quakes because I was told the opposite. Aftershock is like the much more alert 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 so of course uh they're gonna try to calm many down and say everything is fine everything is fine then we should go close the door hey are we gonna get a big one you know i gotta tell my people <laughs> man um but yeah that's what's going on right now guys we're gonna go with this one here We're going to go with this one. You have the Rotten Apple officials ripped for sending Craig alerts nearly 25 minutes after. Actually, it wasn't 25 minutes after. It was 40 minutes after. All right, let's see what's going on here. Here's the thing. This is not like the West Coast. The West Coast, you know, they have that shake alert. I don't know who gave it that name, but uh, yeah, they uh, they have that shake alert. And um, give me a second. I'm just going to have to pause this video. I don't want to get hit with a copyright. There we go. And so this is like the first time they test this. But I've been warning uh, everyone for the past couple of days that... Uh, the warning system is not up to date. All right, so again, be aware and um, always, always be prepared spiritually, physically, and mentally. The Rotten Apple officials were battered by critics Friday after a 4.8 rocked the Rotten Apple, but it took nearly 25 minutes for an emergency alert to go out. Once again, the shake struck near Lebanon, New Jersey, around 10.23 a.m. It was promptly felt across the tri-state area, according to the United States Ge uh, Geological Survey. But the Rotten Apple didn't issue an emergency notify uh, phone alert about the event until 10.47 a.m. They had to send it anyways, because uh, then people's going to be like, oh, you guys really didn't send it, huh? So, again, I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised. What do you expect? It's the rotten apple. 
It then also issued a WE alert, a wireless emergency message to phones at 11.02 a.m. while the state WE alert went out at 11.05 a.m. And some residents reported still getting alerts about an earthquake afternoon. You have uh, Zachary, uh, head of the city, Office of the Emergency Management told reporters at a press conference afterward Friday that the, once again, Eric administration needed to confirm the Craig before alerting residents. See that? I believe there is signs in the heavens that is causing these shakes. Now, some people is going to be like, no, Lewis, according to them, it's, it's not true. Well, remember, um, when Jesus was uh, crucified on the cross, died on the cross, the sun was blocked, and there was an earthquake. So, again, um, I do believe that gravitational pole shift is occurring. I do believe so. Uh, solar flare, eruption, and just the signs of the heavens. Jesus says the heavens will be shaken. For those of you that don't know the heavens, is space, galaxy, all of them, stars, planets, sun, moon, and we are seeing the signs. We are seeing the tip of it. All right. So, again, guys, this is the latest update. I do believe that uh, they are preparing. They are telling everyone to, uh, you know, just remain calm. Give me a second here. Now, this is the one I'm talking about here. An event is long overdue on the New Madrid. I agree. Last time it happened was in 1811, right after, right after total solar eclipse, which had its path of totality on the fault line. Something's going to happen. Again, I'm not saying it's going to happen, but just be careful, be aware. Be aware. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. Again, um, experts are saying there's going to be some more um, shaking, but uh, everything's going to be fine. That's what he said. So, again, please uh, be prepared spiritually, physically, mentally. We are praying for many out there. Um, again, you guys know the Madrid, Missouri. They got hit. I talked about that three, four days ago. And um, I did post a video today about the, the earthquake. So you want to check that out. All the links will be in the comments box. I will keep you updated on this story, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Once again, for those of you that want to give a like to Christ, you can email me. My email is in the description box. Me and my wife are here to help many and to lead many to the righteous path. And that's the path of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. For those of you that want to send us letters or prayer requests, you can send it to me, Luis Santiago, or my wife, Jessica Santiago, at 3432 U.S. Highway 19, number 2, Holiday, Florida, 34691. Once again, guys, $1 a month Patreon. We get your access to our live stream every Sunday. We talk about things that we cannot talk about on the platform. Also, I posted videos today. Those links will be in the comments box. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you all. Put your faith and trust in Jesus Christ, for he's the only way, the truth, and the life. No one gets to the Father but through Jesus. Thank you so much for watching. Till next time later. Peace.